Hi friends, in this video let us see how to shade alternate rows in Excel. This will make your data more presentable and readable. This is a sample data that I consider now as an example. First let us see the first method. Of course the simplest way to shade the alternative rows is by converting this data range to a table. Just place your cursor anywhere within the range and press keyboard shortcut Ctrl plus T. Create table window will pop up with a row selection like this and click the OK button to apply table format on the selected rows. You can create a custom design by going to the design tab. So this is the advantage of using this table method. Now let us see the second method. Select the rows without the header row. Click on the conditional formatting drop down under, under the styles group. Select new rule in the new formatting rule dialog box. Under select a rule type option, select use a formula to determine which cells to format rule. Type the formula as equals to mod open the parenthesis row open parenthesis close the parenthesis comma 2 close the parenthesis equal to 1. Click on the format button to add the color shade that you want to have for alternate rows. Once done press the OK key. Again click OK. Now you can observe that each row with odd number is shaded through like this. You might have understood by now that by using the mod function here in the second method we have the flexibility to shade every third or fourth by just changing the divisor from 2 to the respective number 3 or 4 etc in the mod formula. Got it? So in this way you can shade alternate rows in Excel. If you like this video make sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel right now. Just click on the subscribe button below this video. Thank you friends. Thanks for watching.